Okay, here's what I'm going to do. We're going to prove Stan Meyer's water capacitor. So I'm going to take the wire for the cell and just going to tap it on and off to the transformer that's underneath that battery there. Okay, so I'm just going to tap this on and off. And you can see in this fuel cell, tap it up and down. Takes a bit on and off to get the gas to produce. But anyways, we'll stop now because the gas has proved that it made gas. Now we're gonna take the supply voltage off the cell supply wires. And try this with one hand. And then we're gonna hook it up to an LED. Okay, so these two wires here are from the cell. So let's hook it up to the LED, which works really well. Okay, there's positive. And we'll hook up. Sorry, one hand. <laughs> the negative. And there you have light from the cell. There's the two from the transformer. So move them out of the way. And there you have it. That's just residual power coming off of the uh, cell. So, is it a storage capacitor or a water capacitor? Sure it is. That's around 5 volts roughly. So Stan Myers was 100% correct. There's your proof.